Hey, what is up everyone? This is Kieran here. Welcome back again to Tekken YouTube channel. The new official update for Octavio OS for Redmi Note 8 is out. And this one is Octavio OS with version 3.1, which means based on Android version 12. It was kind of awaited. It's finally here. By the way, this is Octavio OS, which I made a video maybe some days ago about 3.1. That They have included some customizations for you. So almost everything is same with the previous one. It's just about the device specific things. Things are basically same. Not gonna talk about much about this build because this is Octavio 3.1, which I already shown you. The launcher launcher is the pre-installed launcher, and yes, at least something different. A lot of custom rooms, for example, even the ancient custom room also has the Pixel launcher pre-installed. So yes, they have the launcher because no other launcher has a better compatibility with the Android 12 yet. I think so. Other things, for example, the quick settings panel is looking same because it has a white background. In pixel based OS or pixel custom rooms or basically stock pixel devices, you have the black background with something different UI. But almost every custom room has this kind of UI. Yes, in color, of course, you can customize. This is Android version 12. So things have been changed according to the wallpapers. You can see the tiles available, which are useful. Heads up, screenshot, every tile is available here for you. The separate tile for Wi-Fi and mobile data is also present, which is quite useful. So yes, things are quite same. This is good and good enough to use as your daily driver. I think so, but still, this is Android version 12, so I'll not recommend you to use it for now as if this is your primary device. Let me show you if you click on this wallpaper section and wallpapers and styles. You have two wallpapers and styles options available for you and you only have this change wallpaper option. Nothing else. No dark theme, no colors. I saw this a lot of times. I was a little bit confused at why this is showing like this. But as you can see, it has other wallpapers available for you. But the pixel wallpaper and style was not available. But now, if I move on here and then you have this on device and wallpapers and style and now we have the wallpaper colors and basic colors option available for you. How this is possible? You need to simply choose this op this option and you have two wallpapers and styles options by holding at home screen. So that's why. And if you're looking for the themed icons option, which is not present in this one because we're using launcher. So moving on to the launcher settings and journal settings. Here you have the themed icons options present for you which is of course quite useful, quite necessary. Everything else is the same, the speed, the performance, it was expected and almost same like other Android version 12 based custom rooms. I'm not gonna talk about that this is the fastest one because fastest rooms are still Android version 11 based. This is Android 12, so yes, I'll not recommend you. Other things are kinda same, as you can see the customizations, etc. Battery, you can reset the stats, which is actually useful. In some Android 12 custom rooms, I didn't saw this feature, but it's actually useful. I sometimes use this feature. The white battery styles is already present. Now moving on to the customizations section here. The customization section, of course, the bar customizations are present here for you, which is useful. Some quick settings customizations, quick settings photo warnings, and brightness slider in quick quick settings panel. And at bottom, both of the things are working pretty fine. No issues there too. Other options includes notifications, make heads up less annoying is actually quite useful i always use this feature and if you ever saw these videos i have already enabled this feature this is also interesting called monet theming monet customization if you don't want the wallpaper colors you can even customize your own one like this one if you enable this you can use any other color whichever you want to use on your device you can you can customize the white luminance you can customize the liner lightness you can customize the accurate shades a lot of things available here to customize for you so yes it's good i think so other options if you want to customize the custom colors you can and if you know the hex color code this is quite good everything else is the same but i always use the wallpaper theming that looks better so yes let's just do that also if you're able to see volume panel music control and etc same options available here for you navigation menu is kind of same this is the effect which i just want to let you know as you can see very interesting effect available here for you customizations are same but whenever you tap anything the effect seems quite good everything else is same miscellaneous etc the default things are kind of same not going to talk about that everything else i've already shown you if you want to install this build you can and then you can in the terms of gesture section one-handed mode etc everything is same so i have to screenshot nothing to talk about a simple but useful thing if you want to install this i will put the link in the description to install this very very simple thing and it's available for other devices also if you have any other device you can install this on a device if your device is supported this is all thanks for watching i will see you in the next video don't forget to like and share this video goodbye have a nice day
over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air 